Reach Around Books presents Susie Likes to Look at Balls Tiger's balls are small and white, just like Michael Jackson's. These two guys are socialites. They both see lots of action. Tiger puts his balls in holes, keeps them out of sand, while Michael proudly shows his balls to boys at Neverland. Bruce Jenner ran decathlons. He took Olympic gold. But today, I'm sad to say he has no balls to hold. I don't know just what went down. He must have lost a bet. Bruce's balls are Caitlin's now. I'm sure he has regrets. Serena brings some lovely balls to the tennis scene. She has fuzzy little yellow balls, yellowish and green. I think these balls might just be what makes her such a threat. The other girls out on the court haven't got a set. Serena tries to keep them hidden, cause if they're verified, from the Women's Tennis League, she'll be disqualified. Pam has soft and bouncy balls, the kind that must be seen. Hugh Hefner knows how all that goes. They're in his magazine. Hugh Hefner's balls were big and bold, the finest balls around. Then one day, Hugh got old, now his balls drag on the ground. Susie went with Magic Johnson out for some seafood. When she looked at Magic's balls, she really lost the mood. Magic, where is your protection? I think it is too late. Your balls are going to spread infection. It is time to end this date. David Beckham thinks his balls look nice. And it seems the world agrees. He showed his balls once to Posh Spice. The rest is history. Ernie is not at all impressed by what David Beckham's got. He thinks that Spice Girl looks depressed since having tied the knot. Ernie's rented shoes and his wrist brace made David laugh out loud. But the eyes lit up on Posh's face when Ernie pulled his ball sack out. Ernie's balls were beautiful, big and hard and round. When he slid his fingers in, Posh made a funny sound. Ernie rolled those big old balls for a split and then a strike. Now David knows it's Ernie who's got the stuff that ladies like.